Hello everyone, tonight I'm capturing Mars with my Skywatch 800p 8 inch reflector on an EQ5 mount and it's got a motor drive to keep track of the planet so we can keep it on the tiny sensor well not so tiny sensor of my ZWO 585 camera it's a little beast of a camera good for planetary and deep sky I've added a 2.5 times Barlow lens to give us some image scale and here you can see that I've defocused the planet, you can see the shadow of the secondary mirror. I'm checking collimation that that secondary mirror is in the middle. We can see some turbulent air currents, so I'll leave it a while to settle and then start to focus down, getting it tighter and tighter. In doing so it gets brighter, so I drop the exposure down until we can see a good balance between brightness and detail. And we may want to zoom in at this point so we can see a bit better what we're doing. And we do that by just selecting a smaller region of interest. That's about right, I feel. I try and get the histogram about 60%. That seems to work. That was at the bottom right of the screen. And now I'm going top left to set off the capture of 5,000 frames, which will later be stacked together, well, the best frames stacked together in auto stack art to get the best final image. But here are those 5,000 frames being collected and we can see the polar ice caps and the albedo features, the dark features on Mars. And here is the final result after it's been, I think we stacked the best 20% of those 5,000 frames in Auto Stack Art, and then did some final processing in Registat 6. And if you want to find out how to do that, stick around because I show that at the end of the video. But if you don't want to stick around, thanks for watching. And a big thank you to my Patreons and channel members for all you do for the channel, supporting the channel very much appreciate it, it means a lot. And if I can persuade anyone to stay behind, here is the process I used for the final image, stacking in auto stack art, and then doing some final processing in Registat 6. Enjoy, catch you on the next video. Bye for now.